Yo, how's it going, everybody? I hope you're doing great today. In this video, I'm going to show you where you can go in Brimstone Sands to farm out some very fast weapon XP. Bear in mind, though, this place is an elite area covered with a lot of elite mobs. You're going to need a pretty large group to go in here. So if you're a solo player, this probably isn't going to be a great option for you. But we do have some other solo locations listed over at NewWorldFans.com in a leveling guide, a weapon leveling guide. I'll make sure to link that down in the description below. And I'll probably do a video of that one before before fresh start servers come out and show you all of the good solo locations as well but for this video i'm going to show you a great spot in brimstone sands there's a boss that spawns here that drops a few named items and the mobs just continuously spawn over and over and over there is literally no downtime at all so one of the things that you really need to take note of though is that the, the spawn rate is tuned up really really high right now because there's a lot of people in brimstone sands i do think or fully believe this will be nerfed before too long so you want to come take advantage of this while you can because i don't know how long this is gonna last but there's tons of mobs they spawn infinitely you can also loot a lot of glyphs in this area as you kill the mobs it's a great place to come farm out glyphs weapon xp there's a few chests in the area and again the mob drops a few named items none of them are great but there's a few named items that he drops nonetheless so where is this place that we are farming what well, is in the southwestern area of brimstone sands this place is called castrum principium and the boss that spawns here, his name is Godling Jupiterian. And the items he drops is a minor thunderbolt bow. It is a dexterity bow. It comes with chain lightning, lasting rain of arrows, and vicious. He drops a kite shield called the Aegis of the Father. It is a strength kite shield. Comes with keen speed, refreshing move, mortal power. And then he also drops Ambrosia's Burden, which is a constitution earring that comes with regenerating, purifying toast, and refreshing evasion. So none of those are, are too amazing but they're named items there's also some oracalcum that spawns in the area that you can grab while you're there and there are some elite grave offerings that are on either side of this area too so there's a lot of goodies you can grab here as you're farming out so not only are you getting weapon xp you're getting a lot of other goodies as well but that's gonna do it that's it that's the video i just wanted to bring this to you guys real quickly because i don't know how long this is going to be available i'm sure this will get nerfed before too long but get your group together get some company members together come take advantage of this location while it's here if you don't have your great sword leveled or if you need any other weapon leveled or if you just want a place to come farm glyphs this is a pretty decent spot to come do that but that's it boys and girls i appreciate you guys hanging out thank you for watching uh, if you want to come hang out on twitch we stream uh every tuesday through friday eight o'clock a.m cst and uh that'll do it thank you guys for being here we'll see you in the next one